and welcome back to jazzy 61 so today's video is going to be one of my two-week grocery hauls i hope you all enjoyed this video i want to say hello and welcome if you are new here my name is jazz and i do everything motherhood lifestyle and a little bit of beauty every now and again i post on mondays at 4 30 p.m central standard time and i would love it if you would subscribe before you go i'd love to have you and welcome back to my returning and new subscribers i hope you all enjoyed this video let me know what you think in the comment section down below let's go ahead and get into this grocery haul all righty you guys so starting down here on this end we have our breads for the next two weeks so i'll go through them before i go through what's behind it over here we have some texas toast for sandwiches or whatever we feel like eating it with it's usually sandwiches these days i picked up two things with this vanilla brioche bread you guys i really enjoy this bread so i wanted to go ahead and get a couple more of these we have some king's hawaiian sweet rolls as i told you guys before when i get them from sam they go bad really quickly so i've just been getting them from walmart instead they tend to last a little bit longer and then i also got some soft and fluffy home style mission tortilla um, flour tortillas, you guys, just for tacos or fajitas, something I want to make over the next couple of weeks. We have some thick and fluffy blueberry waffles. My munchkin has been eating those as well, so I wanted to pick up a few more of those. Some golden Oreos. That's been my thing lately, so I went ahead and picked up another pack of those. These are some Funnable Cocoa Melon Snacks. My toddler really likes these, so I went ahead and picked up another 10 pack of that for him. And then there is some family size vanilla honey bunches of oats this is for my mom because she usually eats some cereal and i don't think i've had any that she actually would eat so i picked that up for her then over here to our produce you guys we have some fresh mint for teas my mom just reminded me that we had made tea in like a week and i didn't have any mint so i picked some mint up we have some shredded iceberg lettuce some sliced mushrooms. I cooked my last ones when I jazzed up that pasta that I bought from the store. I used all my mushrooms. That's my my infant over there. He's playing with his grandma, guys. So you're going to hear him a little bit in this video. <laughs> then we have some peppers, onions, and tomatoes. So two Roma tomatoes, two bell peppers. We have one yellow, one red, and then a red onion. Then here we have some of those um, grapes that I told you about, those red seedless table grapes that are really good here. So I picked up some of those. I got us some blackberries because mom's been eating a lot of fruit. Ooh, these are some big blackberries in there. Ooh. Okay, got some blackberries. And then I also picked up a small bunch of bananas. That's for a little man because he hasn't had a huge variety of food. I want to make sure we got something different for him as well. On over here, you guys, we have a bag of Doritos. Just the family, a party size bag of Doritos. We have, oh, knocked over, a party size bag of original wavy lays and some cantina thin and crispy Tostitos chips, just because in case I wanna make a fajita or some queso or something, I can have those. I've been really enjoying this Milo sweet tea lately. Is it Milo or Milo? I'm going Milo. Um, so I've been buying this by the gallon. This is what I've been drinking. So I got this, got a half gallon of milk. As I said, I'm the only one that really drinks the whole milk these days. So I got that. We have a little thing of fajita seasoning. Two 16 ounce, I think it's 16. Yeah, one pound box. The smaller ones of the Velveeta. I got the queso blanco and the original. And then these little orange juices are for my mother as well. She typically kind of adds her herbs and things into her orange juice and drinks it. So I picked up two more of those for her as well. Then we're over here to the meats for the next two weeks, you guys. We got some fajita chicken breast strips from Tyson. I like to use these. They make a really quick and easy meal. So I got those. We have boneless, skinless chicken thighs or chicken breasts. Why well, I say chicken thighs? Probably because that's what those are. But boneless, skinless chicken breasts one pack and then two packs of the boneless skinless chicken thighs and then i also got some stew meat because i'm thinking of making that peanut butter stew like i said and i thought i had some stew meat but i actually didn't so i went ahead and picked up some stew meat for that just in case i want to make some of that over here to the non-food area there's some food stuff back there i'll get to that the pouches in a second we have five things of our dog's food you guys this is the tender chicken recipe with carrot peas and brown rice this is the one that he enjoys the most so we went ahead and picked up five more of those for him i was just trying to get this not for the lashes but just the magnetic eyeliner because mine was really thick and clunky and I'm not really sure what happened to it. So let's, I hope that this will work. Um, 
we gonna see. <laughs> and then these are for our baby. So he is getting to the point where he's gonna be drinking out of a bigger bottle soon. So I went ahead and picked up some of these wide neck bottles. They worked really well for him and these are his favorites. They are just smaller, the ones we have are like, I think um, five ounces and these are nine. So I picked up two of those, so I got six. This box, I ordered something for someone for Christmas and um, it'll look weird how it was going to be wrapped. So I went ahead and got this box. I don't know if you guys know Walmart sells like gift boxes. So I got this big gift box. Hopefully it'll fit in this box. If not, it's going to fit. We're going to make it fit. Ah! Moving over here to the pouches. As I mentioned to you guys before, our, our little, our toddler, um, he got sick. And I think his throat was hurting really bad. And so he's really back onto these pouches again because they go down kind of easy. They don't hurt. And now he's kind of afraid to eat regular food because of how bad his throat was hurting. So I just wanted to get some more of these just in case. So I got, this isn't what I actually ordered, but it'll work. <laughs> so we have yogurt, banana, and mixed berry. Yogurt, banana, and strawberry. And apple, mango, raspberry, oatmeal, and avocado. And so he kind of goes through a few of these at a time. So I have to get a lot of them. We still have some left in the pantry, but... I just kind of figured he's going to go through those really quickly. So I just wanted to get a few more. And then, of course, we got some hand sanitizer. You guys know we have it all over our house and in both of our cars. So we want to make sure that I got some more of that just so we have it on hand and that we don't run out. Because as you guys have seen in my house, sick has been rolling through. <laughs> so I want to make sure we have sanitizer ready to go. All right, you guys, that's all I have for you from Walmart. I will check back in with you guys once we get back from the other stores. Hey guys, so we are back from the other grocery stores. I'm gonna show you guys what we got. We went to a local store here. Um, I think they're all over the place, but it's called Market Street. So I'm gonna show you guys a couple things we got from Market Street, and then we'll see what we got from Sam's. Alrighty, you guys. So here is the haul that we got from Market Street. It's not too much, but they do have a much better variety of produce there, and I mean much better than anywhere else. Everywhere, or everything that they get produce-wise comes from farms around the state or around this area so the produce is always always really really good so we picked up two heads of cabbage my mom eats a lot of cabbage you guys and i was looking at walmart and i think somewhere else and the cabbages were so tiny look at how big these are that is a good size head of cabbage there and i've been looking like crazy everywhere and they have been like so small they look like this thing here and that's a squash but um, these are the two heads of cabbage that we got. They also had a great variety of apples. And you guys know these are our favorite, the opal apples. They usually come out at the end of every year. And we hadn't been able to find them. And I was like, I'm going to go over here to Market Street. And, of course, they had them. And they had so many. Oh, my goodness. So I picked up five of them because my husband is not home right now. So these are for me. My mom may eat one, but these are, these are, these are a jazz thing. And then we have a acorn squash. We're meaning to get a butternut squash. We got an acorn. And so hopefully this one's good. My mom's going to mix it with her cabbage, I believe. So we got acorn squash here. Then we have these toaster scramble pastries. This one is French toast and bacon. It has eggs, bacon, and cheese. And then it has like a cinnamon maple crust. When I was younger, there was a little girl that lived up the street from me. And she would always have these in the morning, like a toaster strudel. And I couldn't figure out what it was called um, or couldn't figure out which one. I couldn't find the one that she had. But every morning she would have one of these and she would always break me off a piece of it and give it to me at the bus stop. So I have these. I think these are going to be really good. So I got two boxes. There's only four in each one, but I got two boxes of those. These Red Baron Brick Oven Crust Pizzas. You guys, these are so good. They taste awesome. Um, like you bought it from somewhere. Like you ordered a delivery from somewhere. But these are really good. So I got two because as you guys know, Munchkin loves cheese pizza. So I got two of these pizzas for him and mom tasted it the other day and she thought it was good too so went ahead and picked up two of these and then I got some bluebell cookies and cream ice cream so I know I gotta put this in the fridge soon but a little thing of the bluebell cookies and cream ice cream and then I got a mixed fruit bowl because they also have really good mixed fruit this one has blueberries blackberries grapes pineapples I think a cantaloupe and raspberry in it but they're always really really good and really fresh so I got a mixed fruit bowl all right, you guys, I'll check back in with you once we get everything from Sam's. Hello, everybody. So we are back from Sam's Club. I'm going to go ahead and show you everything that we got from there. And then I'll come back and close this video out.
I'm going to start down here on the floor, you guys. We have some bounty full sheet paper towels. I've been liking the full sheets better again, so I went ahead and got some of the full sheet paper towels. We have some bath tissue. As you guys know, that's my favorite. It's very thick, very absorbent. It doesn't break off. I, I just like that tissue. That's that's my go-to toilet paper right there. So I got some of that, and we got one case of water um, because we still have, I think, two in there. We bought some extra ones this last time, so we had um, two left over from, I think, four. And so I just went ahead and picked up one instead of getting, you know, the normal three. I may just get some more anyway because my mom's back and we go through a lot of water. But I'm not really sure just yet, but I did pick up one case of water. Now up here on the countertop, you guys, we have a few things that are food and then some that aren't food. We're just going to go up here and then move our way back some kind of way. So I got some extra toothbrushes. I always like to have extra toothbrushes on hand when we have guests, things like that. So I picked up this huge eight pack of toothbrushes brushes it wasn't too expensive i think it was less expensive than the like four pack from walmart so i went ahead and picked up this big eight pack we got some mucinex and robitussin you guys because it has been something over here i'll tell you what my once our kids got over rsv it went about a week and then our toddler got an ear infection and with the ear infection it's like a virus of some sort and so he had coughs and he was snotting and everything else. Um, and we're trying to avoid passing it back to the little ones. So we're making sure that we keep ourselves healthy. So we like to keep some of these things on hand. Well, my mom got here and she picked it up. So I picked up some more of this because we went through a lot of Robitussin. It seems to work really well for us. So we got this Robitussin Maximum Strength Cough and Chest Congestion and Nighttime Cough. Then we also got some Mucinex 12 Hour. Then back here, I got my toothpaste. I use Pro Enamel with Sensodyne, you guys. I don't know. I just I just like it better than most things. So I got Pro Enamel with Sensodyne. It's a gentle whitening kind, and it is a four-pack. This usually lasts me a while. So, well, not like a long, long time, but it lasts better than me just going back and forth to the store to get some. So I got that. I got some more paper plates because we went through quite a few of them over the Thanksgiving holiday. Excuse my son's breathing and medicine stuff. That's his breathing machine because of the coughing. They put him on a breathing machine. They gave him a breathing machine to help with the cough so that's what that is over there so just ignore that section back there you guys and the puppy that's what the puppy is um so back there we got some gushers you guys know that is for your girl i love to have me some gushers y'all know that so i got a big box because they finally had them at our local sam's club they have not had them recently so i got some of those and then in front of the gushers you guys we have some chicken noodle soup that's for my mom she asked me to pick up some more she does like a, conco a concoction in her new uh ramen um uh, her chicken noodle soup. So I got another little thing of chicken noodle soup. It's really cold here too. So chicken noodle soup always comes in handy. There's my dog. Uh, he's my... Yeah. Say hi. Say hi, geese. You got something else. Okay. Found some fuzzy socks, you guys. They are so cute. The little furry socks. Um, my sister had some the other day, and I don't have any. I don't think I've ever had any. Um, but I found this big pack, of this two pack of them at Sam's, and they are so soft and so fluffy. So I'm excited for those. And then the last thing that we got from Sam's Club are blueberry muffins because I've been wanting some more blueberry muffins. I have not had them in quite some time. So I went ahead and picked up some blueberry muffins. Okay, you guys, so that's all I have for you today. I hope you really enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. And if you have not already, I would love it if you liked, shared, commented, and subscribed before you left. And please follow me over on Instagram as well. I will leave the handle somewhere on the screen. Thank you all again so much for watching. And I hope to see you in my next video. Bye, guys.